YouTube, how are you now? Sean here from the EDC Den. As you can see, we're in a bit of a different setup today, guys. I've been working like crazy. Haven't had as much time as usual to uh, make some videos for you guys. Um, today I'm doing a quick one on my lunch break. I'm just gonna show you the car console knife, okay? So the knife that has been relegated to my car console. Let's take a look. Let me flip this camera around and I will show you the inside of the console. We'll see what kind of knives we can find in there. All right. Okay guys, I hope the volume's okay. Um, I don't have my my mic set up. I'm just kind of doing this freehand. Here's the console. Here's my car console knives. Now, before we get into it, Canadian hoser alert. We always have to keep a loony and a toonie on deck, right? It's not a Canadian car console unless you have a loony and a toonie in there. Uh, a used lifesaver wrapper. Wintergreen, guys. Not spearmint, no, no, no. Gotta have the wintergreen. All right, first knife, Victorinox, or is it Wenger? Ooh, I gotta check that out. No, it is Wenger, yeah. This is kind of just the little grooming tool. It's got a little pen blade and file. It's got the scissors, and why I really have this is for these nail clippers. They work quite well. You know, I'm a YouTuber, guys, and I, I just show my hands all the time. I can't have nasty, dirty nails for you guys. As soon as I see white on the fingernails, I start cutting. <laughs> all right, so these are, are just kind of a backup set. Of course, I cut my nails in my washroom at home with a normal set. But, you know, this is a good little, good little grooming tool, tool. If anything needs to be snipped or plucked or cut, you got the scissors, you got the clippers, got your toothpick and tweezers. Got this kind of grippy, grippy stuff there. Yeah, good little car console knife. This is the Emerson Mini CQC7. So how did the Emerson Mini CQC7 get relegated to the car console knife? Well, it has a very weak detent, and I don't like the idea of a, a knife with a weak detent in my pocket, just in case the blade goes flying open. I'm also not a huge fan as, of the chisel grinds on these Emerson knives. It's okay, it's different, it's kind of cool. Just not a huge fan. It's not very intuitive when it comes to carving and, and certain types of cutting. But all in all, it's a cool knife. It is fun to carry once in a while. It's great if I forget my knife and I'm kind of feeling naked at work without my knife, I can come to my car and I know I have this one in there just to get me through the day. Let me just switch hands here. Yeah, there's there's the blade. There's a bigger version of this that Emerson makes with a larger blade, same size handle. Just uh, this is the more legal carry size, I guess, an option for those places with some some blade restrictions. But a pretty cool knife. Got this guy in around 2008. Yeah, nice old knife. So that's a super quick video for you guys, just showing you the car console knives. I'd be curious to see what you guys have in, in the car consoles. Decided not to make this an official tag video, but if you guys want to jump in, go out to your cars, show me what you got in there. All right guys, so yeah, just a quick video. Like I said, I am really busy with work these days, but I've never gone a week without posting a video since I started my channel. I, I don't want to start that now. so. I think it's been six or seven days almost, so I'm going to get this video up for you guys today, and there'll be lots more coming on the channel. I've got another really awesome knife from one of uh, one of my viewers, Stuart Harvey. Stuart, thank you so much. That video will be coming out soon. I just want to carry the knife a little bit before I show everybody. Uh, I've got stuff to show you guys from Cold Steel, uh, GEC, Spyderco. Uh, there's going to be lots coming up on the channel, so please stick around on the channel and we will talk to you guys real soon. I'll try and get a video posted um, back in the regular setup at home. So yeah, back to the regular setup and hopefully lots of videos to come very soon. Take care, all my YouTuber friends. Have a great day.